Hey YouTube, it's been a while since I did a video. Thought I'd bring you out today and, and uh, give you a look at how much snow we've got in seven days. Seven days ago, you could see patches of uh, grass here. There was some snow, but not enough to even snowmobile. We had quite a bit of rain. It took pretty much everything we had. You know, we had a couple inches here and there, and that was about it. But like I said, there's there's spots where you could see grass. And within seven days, this is what we got. You can barely see the house, or the first floor of it there. From the kitchen window, you can't see it at all. I gotta shovel that down. That's getting real depressing, being inside, not being able to see outside. That drift up on the second floor there. I gotta shovel that down. Scared of the weight of the, the snow caving the roof in. There's probably oh five and a half, six feet of snow up there. That drift there's gotta be seven and a half. I'm six three and it's a lot taller than I am. In the driveway. It's gonna take me a good three to four hours to get all this cleaned up with the snow blower. I uh, I don't have a tractor. I just gotta walk behind snow blower. But yeah, this is uh, this is what we got in seven days. It's crazy. And they're calling for more <laughs> before the weekend. They say we could get another 15 to 20 centimeters coming Thursday and Friday. That's for the Americans there, that's, I think that's seven, eight inches. Anyway, I'm gonna start getting this cleaned up and I'll, uh, I'll give you a little look later on as I'm, uh, as I'm blowing and stuff. There's what else I got for, uh, I got the little walk behind blower, but sometimes for just small little storms, they're not storms, but small, small little snowfalls and stuff. It's easier just to take the plow out. I just got it out here just to show you it. Uh, once I'm done plow, once I'm done blowing, I'll scrape it down with the blade. That's uh, that's about all the bike's good for really for plowing. You take snow like this, like I just push some up, and that's that's all you can do. And that just came from the front of the car to there and start spinning. I got my tires on this bike studded, and uh, it makes a mess of my. Uh, of my driveway, if I uh, if I spin them, it's just they're not screws; they're just car studs. A lot of them are missing. Oh, geez, that's five years ago I did that, so they lasted pretty good. They uh, they did the trick for what I wanted. Uh, we've done one bike before. Rodney did it, and uh, he he screwed it with sheet metal screws, and it took great hold but it was hard on the tires and stuff I like the I like the car studs better especially running on the rivers and stuff where there's ice or anything like that I don't get out a whole lot biking I uh, mostly use my bike for for doing wood and, and this stuff here a little bit of hunting anyway that's just one of my ways of moving snow all right that's what she looks like all cleaned up I got the window cleaned out so we can see and see if anybody's uh, coming in the yard or just out to the garage. I got the roof all cleaned off. Driveway's done. Mailbox is done. The garage. Truck's all done. The old truck isn't. It stays like that. The vehicles are all ready to go to work in the morning. Anyway, thanks for watching. February storm, February the 3rd. We got a little bit of snow on the way yet. Thanks for watching. Bye.